welcome back to the channel. I'm here with Whitney, the bestie. Um, and today, as you saw in the title, we're gonna be doing all fall things. We're gonna be making apple cider, getting pumpkin spice lattes, carving pumpkins, we're gonna be thrifting. This is just an all fall kind of video. And if you live in Florida, you gotta do what you gotta do to be festive. We're just on this hot ass day doing some fall ass things. Hot girl fall. Some hot Literally. girl fall energy. Let's, what are we doing first? Oh, pumpkin spice, baby. Can I please get a medium, the pumpkin cream cold brew? Sure. Can I add like pumpkin syrup in there? Sure. Like I love a good pumpkin spice latte, but it's really sweet. It's so sweet, and like, I'm not like sweet, no. Literally followed in Goodwill. While we were driving by, he was like licking his lips, but yelling at us, following us into Goodwill, and then saying, How are you? <laughs> FaceTiming people, showing us. Girl, so how are you doing today? Back up. Who are you? I am liking men less every day. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> That's my question. See, that this to me is a perfect looking pumpkin yeah, right looks there. Cool. Look how pretty! Isn't it like so plump and plump? It is! It looks great on camera. <laughs> Pumpkin everything because we ever pumpkin festive. Like I am, I never crave pumpkins until it's fall until time. It's fall. Yeah, no, I never Every, think about it. Pumpkin. Right, and then it's fall, and I'm like everything pumpkin. Everything's gonna be pumpkin. Everything has to be a pumpkin. Everything. So I'm home now and there's Smokey, he's very interested in the camera. Just gonna give you guys a quick little haul before we continue on with this vloggy vlog. I went to <laughs> we went to Walmart really quick and I just got some extra stuff. We also went to Home Depot, strangely, because me and Whitney were looking for a eucalyptus plant to put into our showers because we want to like inhale it while we shower. Anyways, so as you guys know, first stop was Goodwill. I got this really cute bag. I I'm obsessed with it. I like that it's different. It's unique. It's I just got this green bra because I don't know why I find super good bras at Goodwill. This is just the bra I got. And sometimes I just like to sleep in these. Obviously wear it as a bra, but I'm sick of padding nowadays. So you guys saw I got this really cute skirt. Whitney even pointed it out to me. It leaves like a little slit on the side. Don't know what I'm supposed to do with this string. It's a toy for Smokey, I guess. Love that. Uh, so, love, ow, stop scratching. We, as you guys saw, we went to Detweiler. I don't know if Detweilers are very common, but it's pretty much just like a really cheap, like fresh market. It has very affordable stuff. 
I got this pumpkin as you guys saw. It's just white. And I just got this pumpkin as well. This one I'm not gonna carve, but I am gonna carve the white one. Look at that. I love her. At Walmart, I got this lotion. I really like this lotion. It smells so good. It is the EOS Shea Butter 24 Hour Moisture Body Lotion in Vanilla Cashmere. I promise, if you like to smell sweet, it's perfect for you. And I just got some lashes because I was running out. These are the Ardell Wispies. These are my iconic lashes. Like, if you're ever wondering what lashes I'm wearing, it's these. And remember when I mentioned Home Depot? All I got were these battery operated lights at Home Depot. It's gonna be part of my Halloween costume. <laughs> Smokey is so interested in this haul. And also at Walmart, I got these Dr. Teal's sleep candle. It's like a wellness candle. It's in the lavender. Ow! What are you doing? There it is. And Whitney got the eucalyptus one, which I was gonna get first, but this was the last one of this one, and so I just had to. That's actually it for this day of the vlog. I will see you guys as we continue on with this vloggy vlog. Oh god. Okay. Nope, nope. Good morning, my loves. Before we get started on the apple cider and stuff, I just want to give you guys a little, let's just say like makeshift Starbucks drink because this is what I would get at Starbucks for a little bit and I was just like, how can I not spend this much money on it? I'm going to show you guys how to pretty much make a pumpkin chai latte and it's, I'm sure that you know how, it's very simple, but, but if you don't, if this is new to you, then let me be your teacher. You may or may not have seen me make this in the last vlog. If you didn't watch the last vlog, that's perfectly fine. So the ingredients, oat milk. You don't need the skinny latte. I promise that they didn't have any more of the other, the regular tea. So just the Tazo chai latte. And then I got this pumpkin spice creamer. It has almond milk. Got your ice, right? I like to just kind of measure it out. So I put in about a cup of the chai. This is a half a cup, that's why I'm doing two. I do a cup of chai and then a cup of oat milk. It obviously does not matter what milk you use. I just prefer oat milk because I feel like it adds the, the thick creaminess to the drink. I can totally froth this up. Um, I've done it, so let's let's just do it for the sake of the video. So I just have this little frother thingy. I'm just going to, this is a new one, so. A little bit of this into here. Not too much, maybe like that much. That's a lot, but froth around here. I wanna froth for a second because I want it to be pretty thick because I want it to sit on top like pumpkin cream cold foam. Um, but normally the drink I would get is an iced chai tea latte with oat milk and pumpkin cream cold foam. And I was like, why does this seem so simple to make at home, but I'm spending $10 on it? What the fuck? I take my thick, creamy substance. Pour it on the top like cream cold foam. Mm. I love it because it has like caffeine in it and everything but it's not like too intense like coffee and coffee also just gets my stomach super just not the best feeling ever. So this, real easy on me, super good. So yeah, I recommend it, but now we're gonna make some apple cider.
legitly just woke up. Um, thankfully, I don't sound as tired as I did when I made the cider. I'm gonna try the cider. I wanted to wait to try it until on camera because I'm loyal like that. This is just some store-bought pumpkin bread that my mom got from Detweiler's, actually. Like, it actually smells so good, so I can't wait to try that. Cider first, okay? So excited. Y'all, normally it's not this color. Like, this color came out so dark. Normally my cider is like a little lighter orange color. Sorry, that's the water is my pool. But this came out so, like, dark, which I like. It's, like, cool. I think it's because, like, the apples I used were just different. But it tastes so, like, I don't know. It sat in the, it sat in the water for a while. So I think the longer it sits in the water, the darker the juice gets. Wow, it's so good. The perfect amount, you know? It's not too much, it's not too little. Mm. I honestly could add sweetener, like a little more sweetener. Like y'all saw what I added. I honestly could add more. Not bad. Never made pumpkin bread before in my life. I would love to make some pumpkin bread to compare it to this. It's like the initial taste of the bread is not that great, but then the aftertaste hits. Let's set an intention for our day. My intention. Universe, bring to me what is meant for me. Love you and I know you're listening. I love me. I love you. Cleanse you. Everyone gets it. I know if you have a pet. No, it doesn't matter if it's a cat. No matter what animal it is, you just can't help but like look at them sometimes. Just like, love Don't forget to express your gratitude today. There are a lot of days that go by where we forget to do it. And remembering what you're grateful for just kind of brings more grateful things to you because you feel as though you already have enough and then once more abundance comes into your life, you're just like, wow, I, can't, I couldn't be more grateful. I definitely say to express gratitude, whether it's in your head, whether you write it down, no matter what it is, as long as you express your gratitude to at least somebody, maybe another person, you can express your gratitude for them. Anything that you can do that's expressing gratitude, even your mom making you a meal, will feel as though you are so abundant and you don't need anything else so tomorrow's gonna be the last day of this vlog and then we're gonna carve the pumpkins i'm so excited i'm going with my two besties this is actually andy's camera um that he is letting me use for some reason because he's amazing everyone express gratitude for andy andy yes because Without this camera, I would not feel as creative as I feel and I wouldn't feel as motivated to make these videos as I feel. So, so much gratitude for Andy, so much gratitude for Whitney, so much gratitude for everybody. I'm really excited for tomorrow. We're going to prosper and make it work. And I'll see you guys in a second. Give me a Spanish friend. Oh my God. I'm not a loser. I'm a winner. We oh. Okay guys, we're about to leave, but just check out this fit real quick. Jellyfish is on! I'm a wiener. I am a wiener. What just happened? What? I get around, baby. I get around. I have these LED lights that I showed you guys earlier. They look so good. In the hair, I knew it. I knew they were. Look at the look at the fishy vibes. These are lanterns that we made into hats. Jellyfish head hats. Here gets such good pictures. Oh yeah.
Hold up. <laughs> what? My server! <laughs>